yeah good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you're watching from the lord bless you and cause his face to shine upon you today happy sunday hope you're preparing to go to church hope you really have a mind to go to church today and i hope you'll go in the right heart remember we're going to worship god in spirit and in truth you're not going in flesh or your fleshly attire and then you are real just to kill someone or so that somebody will see your new clothes or see your shape no you're going to serve a holy god you're going to give god your true worship Remember, God is a spirit, and you must worship Him in spirit and in truth. Anything you do out of the flesh today, know that God doesn't like it. Anything you do out of the flesh, know that it is not to the worship of God. And today is a day to worship God. May God give you the grace to worship Him in spirit and in truth. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. We come here to receive from God daily, to eat this daily devotional as God gives to us. Amen. This is every word of God for daily living. bless you i give you glory honor adoration i exhort you lord for there's none like unto you O god king of glory lord of lord lion of the tribe of judah O lord yes the lion and the lamb i worship you i bless you lord faithful father mighty redeemer great god hallowed be your name thank you father for our lives thank you O god for defeating the powers of darkness against our life thank you O god for giving us victory for the powers of satan thank you for waking us up this morning and giving us good health strength oh lord thank you father lord for defeating the forces of darkness that is against us who go oh yes lord jesus you have made a show of shame of the enemy oh god and you blunt out the oddness is written up against us oh god oh yes and you triumph over satan in victory hallelujah we give you glory lord in the name of jesus oh glory 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 to the lord oh glory 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 to the lord hallelujah hosanna 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 blessed be the name of the lord hosanna 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 blessed be the name of the lord you are so good and mighty oh mighty god you are so good you are so kind oh god oh mighty god you are so good you are so great oh god oh mighty god you are so good and mighty oh mighty god you are so good you are so kind over oh mighty god you are so good you are so kind oh god oh mighty god hallelujah hallelujah to the king of glory who was who is and shall forever be great and mighty god the lily of the valley the bright and monastery first and last lord hallelujah be to your glorious name lord be thou exalted we worship you we exalt you we worship you jesus be thou exalted oh lord our glory honor adoration to your glorious name you are good oh yes your messengers forever be thou exalted father in the name of jesus we are here to hear from you oh god speak to our hearts oh god oh lord prepare our hearts for today teach us oh god a word that will stay with us oh god a word that will help us to walk with you oh god diligently to you come we pray in the name of jesus amen let your walk on with power to heal to deliver to set free oh god today we pray in the name of jesus blessed be your name i bind the powers of darkness against your word i bind the forces of darkness against your word that shall not prevail satan the lord rebuke you i rebuke you and i cast you out of the minds of people out of the hearts of people god's will will be done god's way will prevail in the name of jesus the word of god shall prevail in the name of jesus i will begin to see fruits in the life of people in the name of jesus thank you father lord blessed be your name speak oh god yes we hear you speak lord jesus we open up our heart to receive blessed be your name oh god thank you father in jesus name we pray amen and amen amen we give god glory hallelujah Thank you once more for watching. Thank you once more for staying up to this time. We give God the glory in the name of Jesus. Amen. Our topic today is... God has made 
Pastor Parika, a father in Christianity. Hallelujah. Amen. This is by Pastor Parika, the international director of the Holiness River Movement Worldwide, short form Horemon. And today is Sunday, October 24th. 2021. Amen. Hallelujah. Our text is taken from the book of Revelation, chapter 22, verses 6 and verses 16. Verse 6. But this thou hast, that thou hatest the deeds of the Nicolaitans, which I also hate. 16. Repent, or else I will come unto thee quickly, and will fight against them with the sword of my mouth. Our text is taken from the book of Matthew, chapter 4, verse 11. Then the devil levered him, and behold, angels came and ministered unto him. Continuation of the angelic message. This is a continuation of, of a message, of an angelic message. Amen. We read in Jesus' name. The angels continued. The position the Lord has to give you is as though you have worked for him for over 80 years. The position belongs to a person who has worked for so long a time before the Lord. Amen. Paul, you will serve as a father to strengthen and comfort other people. You shall not be the one looking for people. The Lord shall make people look for you. Amen. Amen. And we are seeing this happen. This is about uh, an angelic visitation, a message that was given to our father in the Lord, Pastor Parika, the writer of this daily devotional. We bless God for his life. Amen. We are seeing the God confirming his work and what he is doing. He says that he shall not go to look for people, but people shall go to look for him. That this work that he is doing, God is going to give him a very high uh, 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 position to be fathers of all that, which we are seeing. is a lot. He's a father of a lot of ministers already teaching them the right way, teaching them the right way to go, to serve God in righteousness and in holiness, in truth. Amen. Amen. We bless God for this. Lord is going to give to you, Paul, is so high. As a result, the Lord is passing you through various processes, including suffering, to make you qualify for the high placement you are going to receive from God. People shall see your credentials, your wisdom, knowledge, understanding, works, and sufferings for God, and, and acknowledge that you truly merit the high placement that God will give to you that the lord has given to you amen amen those who are who are sinians in the faith and those who are in the Lord why he raised a young one to be their leader. Amen. 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 Indeed, we as we know the wisdom of God. I will say we know, not just that we are saying we know the wisdom of God that God has given to this wonderful man of God. When he preaches the word of God, you see him, you see him break down the word of God and teach it just the way it is. He doesn't add, he doesn't remove just the way the word of God is. Hallelujah. We bless God for his life given is that the God of all comforts comfort us in our tribulations that we all know how to comfort them who are in any trouble God is saying I will allow you to face this so that you will be a father indeed amen yes I will make you a father in Christianity that others will find comfort in your life amen amen yes indeed when a father goes through struggles and goes through pain you see sometimes the children don't even know but sometimes they know when they see their father working hard I, I remember a lot of people they, wait, they, they, they say oh I know when my mother will say her rapper to take me to school those are the time of suffering we are seeing the suffering that this man of god is going through just because he's standing in true holiness just because he's standing in true righteousness he doesn't want to compromise even his children go ahead to rebel against him just like the rich man that the, that 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 the, his younger son said give me all i have i want to break out i want to go and set my own but what did he do he squandered them all we even see people leaving this ministry saying that they want to go 
cannot stand on their own. They cannot stand on their own because they don't have this. They are not the father. The, the Bible says that we have to be in the vine. For Jesus, Jesus is the vine and we yield ourselves to him. If we cannot do nothing except we yield ourselves to Jesus. Amen. So we cannot do anything except we yield ourselves to that man of God that God has ordained for this time. Hallelujah. May God help us to continue to be humble under this ministry, under this man of God that God has prepared for this time. May God continue to give us grace to hold on in the name of Jesus. May God continue to give us grace to, 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 to be humble, to serve in, in humility in the name of Jesus. Amen. We thank God for his life. We thank God for what God is doing in his life. I am bringing sound Christians to look up to you. I am the one removing all these evil ones from you. Hallelujah. I will put good people around you. Amen. You that will walk. I will put good people around you that will walk with you with pure hearts. Hallelujah. Can you see? The Lord is the one within around me. Say amen. Amen. This is Pastor Rika referring to himself now. The Lord is the one within around me. All those grass that are not real again. Hmm. All those grass that are not real grain. He will pull them out. He is pulling them away. Jesus himself is pulling them away. He will replace them with good people that will walk with you with good hearts. Stand firm to defend me. Stand firm to defend me, your Lord. Don't look back. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's the word. Don't look back. Amen. I just thank God for this daily devotional. And this, it's over. It's just a revelation that, has, that, that was being shared here. The message of the angel. Amen. Just like the message, the angel came to Mary and gave a message that yes, you will be, you, you have a, a child of the most high. And the angel also went to a, a, a Elizabeth and then he told her, oh, you will have a son. Uh, uh, sorry, went to Zechariah, the wife, the, 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 the husband of Elizabeth, that you will have a son and his name will be called John. The angel of God is also coming to, 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 to give us this revelation about Pastor Porica to see his good work. Let the Lord affirm your work. Let the Lord also glorify himself in your work. Amen. Don't look back in that service you are doing for God, in that work you are doing for God, whether you've been persecuted, whether you're suffering for Christ, whether you are, or, or your friends have left you or, 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 or they call you names or they rejected you. Even they sack you from job, you don't know what to do anymore. Keep holding on to God, my dear. Keep holding on to God and God will come and affirm himself in your life. Jesus will come and glorify himself in your life. And you will see that things will begin to take place. You see the first statement we heard there. He said that he will not look for people, but people will look for him. That means both kings and nobles and governors and presidents, both small and great people will look for him. This is what the word of God is saying. Yes, when you stand your ground as a child of God, God, the Lord will send his angel to bring your blessing. The Lord will send his angel to bless you. Yes, Zechariah, we were reading about him a few days ago. How he stand. The Bible says he and his wife was without sin. They were blameless in the sight of God. They were doing the services of God. And God sent his angel, my dear. God's angel is on his way to you. Don't look back. Don't sin. Don't do anything that is against the will of God. Continue. Even though it seems so hard. My dear, your blessings is just at the door. Keep doing the work of God before you know aha all hail you will hear from the angel greeting you and bringing you good tidings hallelujah amen may God give us the grace to continue to stand strong walking in his vineyard doing the will of God oh not falling into temptation not yielding to the wells of the devil oh God but overcoming standing strong with the whole armor of God gilding ourselves with the truth oh putting on the breastplate of righteousness wearing the helmet of salvation they they are not praying, oh, persevering with the word of God. They are not. May God give us grace to stand in the name of Jesus. Father, we release your grace upon us that we will have good testimony also, oh God. Father, we pray in the name of Jesus. Amen. Jesus, I pray for that your grace upon that man, upon that boy, upon that sister, oh God. I pray for your grace upon their life, oh God, to stand in true righteousness, in true holiness. That's why it seems so, whether it seems so difficult to them or not. Father Lord, I pray for your grace that they will not give up their faith. Oh, 
world, they will not go back to the world. That's is that I trade away our jewelry and our, our, our everything fake, things you hate in our life. Father, I pray for your grace, oh God, for how to continue to stand in your righteousness, in your holiness, in your will, in the name of Jesus. She will not look back. She will not go back to her old boyfriend. Oh no. She will not continue to sleep with my man. In the name of Jesus. I pray for grace for that boy to leave that girl. Oh, that she's sinning with. Oh, I pray for grace for your children to stand in righteousness, in holiness to the end. Oh, until our change come, until our blessing come, until the trumpet sound, until we go to heaven. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Blessed Father, I thank you, Lord. Glory be to your name. We will not look back. Yes, we will not look back. For Lot's wife looked back and she became a pillar of salt. We will not look back. I pray for grace not to look back. We will not look back by the message of God. We will continue to hold strong. Hold strong to the end. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, thank you, Father, for your blessings, oh God. Thank you for your word. Thank you, Father, for he that has the good tidings on his way come. It shall meet us in good faith. In the name of Jesus. It shall meet us in good faith. In the name of Jesus. We will not be out of place when our blessing shall come. In the name of Jesus. When the blessing of Zechariah came, he was in place. He was in place of his blessing. He was not out of faith. He was not sleeping at home. He was not being tired or weeping or gnashing. He's still saying he doesn't have a son. The Lord met him in service. May God God give us the grace to always be in service. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name. Thank you for speaking to us this way. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. We've come to the end of this daily devotional today. The thought of the day is, Huremon is raised up to promote and defend the truth. Amen. The truth. What's the truth? The truth is the word of God. The truth is the standard of God. The truth is the doctrine of God. The truth is what God has said the way it is. That is God's word. That is what we do. That is what we defend. That is what we carry on. In the name of Jesus. I want us to lift up our voice and begin to pray for this wonderful man of God that God has made in this time. Let's begin to pray that more grace upon him. That God will give him grace to continue to stand. He will not fall. He will not fail. He will not sleep. He will not slumber. He will continue to walk in the righteousness and the holiness of God to the end. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I pray for Pastor Parika. Oh God, for you have chosen him. Oh God, in this generation. Oh God, to lead your children into holiness and righteousness. I pray, oh God, for your grace upon him, for upon his wife, upon his ministry. Oh God, this ministry, oh Lord, that he will not fail you. We will not fail you. In the name of Jesus, I pray for your grace, for him to continue to walk in your righteousness, in your holiness. The devil, oh God, has fought a lost battle. He has failed concerning his life. In the name of Jesus, I pray for Melinda for more strength and grace upon her life, oh God, that they will carry on to the end, that when you come, you will meet them in faith, loving Jesus, serving Jesus, they will not sleep in the name of Jesus, they will not slumber by the blood of Jesus, oh God, they will continue walking in truth and in spirit, doing your will, doing your work, serving you Jesus, to the end, to the end, in the name of Jesus, and we holding on to them, oh, we walking together with Jesus, oh, we will not be, we will not be removed, Our, we will not fall away like branches, we will not fall away like leaves, we will hold on, oh God, to your truth, Till the end, till the end of time, in the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Blessed be your name, Father. Thank you, Father, for your grace, oh God. Blessed be your name. We give you glory and we receive this grace not to look back, but to hold on to the end. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen, amen, amen. Hallelujah, we give God glory. That's a word we have received today. Don't look 
back. Continue to look forward. The Bible says, look unto Jesus, the author and the finisher of your faith. In no matter the, no matter the situation, in no matter the circumstance around you, continue to look unto Jesus. Look unto his word. Look what he has for you. Look to his promises. Look to his word. Look to what he says is to come. Look unto Jesus. Your life, your, your, your source, your God, your greatness, your resources, your everything, your protector. Everything. Jesus is everything. Look unto him and follow him and you will never be misdirected. You will never lost your way as far you look unto Jesus. For when Peter looked away from Jesus, he began to sink. You look to Jesus. Don't move your eyes to Jesus from Jesus. As far you are looking unto Jesus, my dear, you will not sink. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We give God glory for today. May God empower us and give us the grace to be focused on him in Jesus name. Amen. Have a wonderful day. The Lord bless you and God's face to shine upon you. Have a wonderful Sunday in the presence of God. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Amen.